Hello, this is Steve Burgess from Hypnotherapy for All. Thank you for choosing this recording. I hope you enjoy listening to it and you find the visualizations, suggestions, or affirmations helpful in your quest to feel good. Now, before you play the recording, make sure you won't be disturbed for the next little while. Turn off your phone and find somewhere comfortable to sit or lay with your eyes closed. Obviously, do not play the recording whilst you're doing anything that requires concentration. For example, driving or operating machinery. If you have a history of psychiatric illness, before you listen, check with your doctor that it's okay for you to do so. Hypnosis is just a pleasant state of relaxation. So if you need to come back to full awareness or respond to anything happening around you before the recording is finished, simply count yourself up in your mind from 1 to 10 and open your eyes. So when you're ready to begin the process of relaxing and the process of using the power of your subconscious mind to heal your body, Allow your eyelids to close down over your beautiful eyes and just go inside and begin the process of relaxing. Now there are so many ways to relax and of course many times in the past you have relaxed but it may just be that on this occasion you allow yourself to relax now deeper than you have done for some time allowing the sound of my voice to be a comfort to you and letting go of gentle background sounds and noises it's perfectly natural to hear background sounds and noises whilst you're relaxing but just do your best to let them go and you may actually find, and some people do, that whatever you hear from now on actually helps you to go deeper into relaxation now. So I'm going to ask you just to allow your mind to focus into your body now. Become aware of your body as you sit or lay Get a sense of where you are in space and time. The air around you. I'm going to ask you to begin the process of imagining a pleasant wave of relaxation flowing down through your body. I'm going to ask you just to think about relaxing some of the muscles in your body. And as you think about relaxing these muscles, they can relax. And as they relax, as you relax, just allow yourself to drift and float deeper and deeper into relaxation now. So firstly, just imagine the wave of relaxation flows down through the muscles of your forehead and face and jaw. Imagine those muscles going loose and smooth and relaxed. Imagine your eyelids feeling comfortably heavy and relaxed. Perhaps you can become aware of a warm and welcoming darkness behind your closed eyelids. And just allow your mind to rest on the muscles of your forehead and face and jaw feeling comfortable now. Just allow the relaxation to move down into the back of your neck and shoulders. Imagine a weight is being lifted off from your shoulders 
and you can feel calmer now and more relaxed. And just allow the relaxation to move down your back, down your spine, down and down and down to the lower part of your back. And as those muscles let go, just feel your body drifting and floating deeper and deeper into relaxation now. And then just imagine the wave of relaxation moves down through your arms, all the way down from your shoulders, down through your elbows, down to your wrists. Just allow your arms to feel loose and limp and relaxed. And just focus on your breathing. Become aware of the gentle rhythm of your breath. As you let your mind rest, on the rising and falling of your breath. And you can allow yourself to go even deeper, even further into feelings of relaxation. Perhaps you can even get a sense of calmness inside as your body begins to settle down and calm down. And as you're focusing on the rhythm of your breathing, just allow yourself to become very present. Watching your breath in this way is a wonderful way to come into the now, into this present moment. So just spend a few moments now as I remain silent. Just letting your mind rest on the gentle rhythm of your breathing. Now just imagine that wave of relaxation flowing down through your legs, from your hips, down through your knees and ankles, all the way down to the tips of your toes. And just get a sense of your body relaxing. If there's any tension anywhere in your body just imagine breathing into the tension and then just breathe it away. Allowing yourself, giving yourself permission to let go and relax now. And now in your imagination, just imagine a blanket of safety and relaxation being pulled gently up over your toes, over your ankles, over your knees and thighs. And this blanket of relaxation brings with it feelings of inner calm and comfort. It slowly continues moving over your knees and thighs to your pelvis then over your fingers and tummy and hands. And then this blanket of relaxation comes to rest gently on your chest so that your entire body is secure, relaxed and at ease now. Whilst I remain silent for a short time, 
Just allow yourself to go even deeper into relaxation. And as you're resting in this very pleasant way, imagine a white, warm, glowing ball full of purifying light begins to form over your head. And magically, this warm, glowing ball is made up of a healthy, cleansing white mist. And you can perhaps get a pleasant sense of it as being good and positive, full of comfort and security. And imagine this white, warm, glowing ball full of purifying light as it descends around your head you are able to begin to breathe this wonderful white mist into your body. And as you focus on that white, warm ball full of purifying light, you can begin to breathe this wonderful white mist into your nostrils or mouth. And as you do this, Perhaps you can already feel yourself breathing deeper and easier. As you breathe this healing, purifying light into your mouth or your nostrils, this wonderfully healthy, beautiful, cleansing white mist begins to heal all of the tissues of your body as it slowly begins to soothe and coat your throat, then gently moving down through your body. Moving now into your stomach and completely coating the lining of your stomach with a feeling of soothing softness, creating a beautiful healing process in your stomach. And now slowly the mist flows down into your intestines, coating the inside of your intestines with this wonderful, white, calming, healing, protective mist. A coating that protects your intestines from all forms of irritation. And now it's moving slowly and softly into the colon and it soothes its way through, thoroughly coating the colon with that healing white mist, protecting it from any future possible irritants. Imagine too that as you breathe in, with each breath, you are not only breathing in this healing white mist down into your body from the ball of mist above and around your head, but you're also breathing it back up through your body so that it recoats everything again inside you, pulling this healing white mist back up into the colon and intestines, doubling the wonderful new line of protection for your colon now and in the future. This healing form of protection 
will not allow any food or irritation to bother your intestines or colon again. So imagine you're pulling the white mist back up into your intestines now. Thoroughly coating them with the soothing white mist to prevent any possible irritation in the future. The mist gives you long lasting protection. Now the white mist moves back up into your stomach. Again, recoating the surface and doubling that wonderful protection that lasts and lasts. Just spend a few moments now visualizing this process taking place. The healing white mist soothing its way through all of your organs. And as you're doing this, imagine you can feel all of those organs of your body relaxing. As though each pleasant breath that you're taking is breathing a deep sense of calmness and relaxation down into your body. And perhaps you can become aware of a sense of peacefulness, a feeling of calmness that starts to flow through you. And maybe you can notice your body softening and easing down. And as you allow this healing process to take place throughout your body, you can take a few moments to know that change is possible. And change can be brought about by retraining your thoughts, both consciously and subconsciously. Because every thought that you think produces a physical reaction in your body. However, somewhere in the past, your subconscious mind interpreted some event or set of events in a way that produced anxiety that has become lodged in your body, creating the effects we call IBS. And your subconscious mind felt that by doing so, it was keeping you safe. But that thought process is no longer needed. So firstly, I'd like you to go to that part of you, wherever it may be, that allows change. And to thank it for the response it is producing. Because it has been doing this to keep you safe. However... You are safe. So just create an awareness that you are thanking a part of your body. And when you have done so, let that part of you know that these responses in your body are no longer needed. And it is your desire that those old anxiety responses are now released. And as your subconscious learned how to produce those responses, it can now learn how to change them. First reducing them, and then when it's time to do so, now, eliminating the effects completely. Your digestive system is monitored by the parasympathetic nerve and the digestive system works by squeezing food down through the stomach and intestines and colon. And usually it works perfectly well without you having to think about it. However, the effects of irritable bowel syndrome 
are produced when that process happens too quickly or too slowly. And when it happens too slowly, we become constipated. When it happens too quickly, we get diarrhea. And with both of these, we get stomach pains and bloating, etc. What we need to do now is to get the right pace to slow down or to speed up this process of peristalsis, the process of the digestive system squeezing food down through the stomach, intestines and colon. So, picture and imagine in your mind a big wooden lever, the type that used to be used alongside railway tracks to change the points on the track. And this lever speeds up or slows down your digestive system. If you'd like to imagine this as a dial instead of a lever in your mind, then that's quite acceptable. Imagine you put your hands on this lever. And if you push it forward, it allows your digestive system to speed up. So if you become constipated, Push this lever gently forwards and imagine your digestive system speeding up until it feels more comfortable. Perhaps you can imagine above the lever numbers ranging from 0 to 10. 0 represents the level of discomfort you feel at the start of the time you use this lever. And 10 represents total comfort and perfect working of your digestive system. As you move this lever, see the dial moving too, until it comes to rest on a number that represents the comfort level in your stomach. In the same way, if you have diarrhea, see your hands on the lever and pull the lever gently back so it slows down the digestive system. And once more use the comfort scale on the dial to monitor where you are on the scale. I'll leave you to do that now for a few seconds. You can also imagine the squeezing of your digestive system, like a wave running down a caterpillar's body. And that wave can speed up or slow down as needed. All the time being controlled by your hands on the big wooden lever. The more you do this exercise, the easier and the more effective it will be. And the quicker the response will take place in your digestive organs. Now you can play this recording regularly. But you can also each day give yourself a few moments of relaxation. And visualize the lever moving one way or the other. To speed up or to slow down your digestive system. And imagine a scale from 1 to 10 in your mind's eye. So remember now, every thought you have can affect your body. So you can notice now your thoughts becoming positive, more and more positive. In this way, your body can respond positively, creating now more and more positive effects overwriting the negativity that produces symptoms of IBS. And this can leave you feeling freer, safer and calmer. 
because you are safe. You are safe. You are safe. So as each day goes past now, just allow your thoughts to become more positive, using more positive words, using more positive self-talk. And as you do this, your stomach will follow. It will feel calmer and more positive as each day goes by. In a few moments now, it will be time to start slowly and gently coming back to full awareness. Back to today and tomorrow and all the other good days just around the corner. Good days where your stomach feels calm, relaxed and at ease. Good days in which you notice a feeling of safety and security in your body and mind. So in a few moments, I'm going to slowly count up to 10 and with each number, I ask you to come back little by little to full awareness on the count of 10. And when you come back to full awareness, bring back good feelings with you. Allow feelings of calmness to remain with you for the rest of this day and evening perhaps long after this session has completed. So let my voice go with you now. And with the number one, just slowly start coming back little by little. And then back to two, gently coming up to three, with each number coming back more and more alert now. Gently and slowly up to four. All the way to five. And more and more alert now back to six. All the way back to seven. Gently coming back up to eight. All the way back to nine. When you're ready, number 10. Take some nice deep breaths, have a good stretch, open your eyes and feel good now.